Right, check this out. Irvine police stop a car that is like something out of a James Bond movie. Gadgets galore. Do you see what's happening there? But police say this car was built for crime. Two people were arrested after police say they went on a crime spree in Orange County. KKL 9 Orange County reporter Michelle Geely live now in Garden Grove to show us that amazing getaway car. Michelle. Juan, one of the suspects, Chris Hoon, lives right behind me here, and the sheriff's department has now confirmed that he has been released from custody. According to Irvine police, he and a female accomplice would prey on people who live in large apartment complexes and people who would leave their cars unlocked. Now, according to those officials, as the duo would leave those complexes, they would push a button inside of their car that would activate a device that would make it harder to catch them. Oh, like a Hollywood movie. James Bond style technology has made its debut in an Irvine criminal investigation. On the police Instagram page, there's a demonstration of how the suspects disguise their license plate. They have this kind of James Bond flipping uh, license plate uh, in the back, and the reason they do that is to hide the license plate so we can't identify the car and who owns the car. A push of a button and the plate is gone, according to Sergeant Davies. Suspects Chris Hun and Yasmeen Cambor were arrested Tuesday in their high performance Mercedes, where officers say even more was recovered in the burglar's bag of tricks. We noticed they had a very sophisticated fuel pumping system in the back where they could presumably siphon gas out of other people's vehicles. The duo compared to Bonnie and Clyde by officers are being investigated in a string of recent auto burglaries in Irvine and Newport Beach. They allegedly hit parking structures in large apartment complexes. Stephen Carlson lives at one of them. That's incredible. I mean, that's scary. And what the new the criminals are doing new things every day and the general public, we don't know what's going on. And uh, good thing there's cops out there helping stop these guys. <laughs> hey, Chris! One suspect, Chris Hun, was released on bail this afternoon. Yasmin Cambor is still in jail. We went to his house in Garden Grove and found the white Mercedes in the backyard. Now, police tell me that they nabbed these suspects on Tuesday as they were making their getaway from yet another apartment complex. One of the residents at that complex recognized that distinctive Mercedes and dialed 911. As for the fe female suspect, she is still in custody. She's also accused of stealing a car. Uh, no word yet on her release. That's the latest live in Garden Grove. I'm Michelle Geely. Back to you. Pretty